Sports Plus. That's, that's Sports the, Plus. the most extreme. That's right? correct. I can see now why James Bond drives these cars. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we're gonna try something totally different as a consideration for my daily driver and it's an Aston Martin. Now, I used to have a Aston Martin Vanquish S many years ago and I loved it. Little heavy, but nothing like the sound of that exhaust when you push that red starter button. So, let's go check it out. I'm guessing this is the car. I used to have a Vanquish S many okay. years ago and I loved it. Nice. Obviously a little heavy car. Yeah. What's the weight on this puppy? Uh, this one's right around 4,000 pounds, a little okay. bit under. Okay. I think Vanquish was like 4,300, yeah. maybe a little bit more, but wow. This looks gorgeous. I love how the, has a white body on the rear and the front. Yep. So what's a zero to 60? Uh, it's about In three, three on this one. Three, three? Yeah. Okay. All right. Oh, well, nothing's like the actual test drive. Do they make other variations or only coupe? We do make other variations. We make the DBS Superleggera Volante, which is uh -huh. the convertible version of the DBS. Say no more. <laughs> I smoke cigars and one of the requirements is topless. So there I had no go. idea. So we have uh, one you, inside. Come on in, take a look at it. Let's do it. All right. Right now it's green in the front and it's purple in the back. Yep. Crazy. So we commissioned this through Q, which is our bespoke department and we went up to them and said hey have you guys ever done a color changing paint before they said no we said okay let's make it happen so it took about a year and yeah. a half to get these cars in so we did a matching convertible wow. and coupe behind us well you know what funny you say that i tried that on one of my cars a p1 mclaren and it didn't work out so well oh, really? <laughs> so i had to go back to regular exposed car running mat now driving wise obviously aside from getting a whole bunch of wind in your head is there anything different than a coupe? No, it's no? the same horsepower. Yeah, same horsepower, same torque. Yeah. It's about 200 pounds heavier than the coupe version. Yeah, because of the mechanical Correct. Yeah, top. Yeah. 200 pounds. And what's that behind it? Same as this color, just in coupe. Same exact version, just in coupe. So we wanted to do a matching coupe and convertible, yeah. something that's never been done on an Aston Martin before. We figured, let's do it with chroma flare paint. All right. Well, I can't wait to test drive it. So let's, let's it. go out. Yeah. Follow me. Oh, wow. The doors kind of open up. Swan doors. It's a 12 degree angle. And the reason being is they're not as exotic as the full gold wing doors, yeah. but you don't hit any curbs or any yeah. type of high areas yeah. with that. You don't hit curbs, but you may hit my nose and I need a new <laughs> nose drop. Put Ooh. on the brake. I love how the speakers pop up. Yep, that is Bang & Olufsen yeah. speakers. Very cool. So when you turn on the car, it turns yep. on in GT mode. So it has three different drive modes. It has mm -hmm. GT, Sport, and Sport Plus. Okay. So you can access that by clicking the S button. So what that wow. does is it opens up the exhaust valves, yep. holds the shifts higher and makes them a little bit more swift. Oh yeah, now we're done. Sports Plus. That's, that's Sports the Plus. most extreme. That's right? correct. All right, guys. We're gonna take this puppy for a test drive. Right off the bat, I love the design and the form of the steering wheel. It's more racy. It's kind of like La Ferrari-ish, you know. All right. Drive. Sport Plus mode. It's the only way to drive Aston. Wow. And look at the size of these pedal shifters. No way you can miss that. So this has always been a thing. Do you like when the paddle shifters are on the wheel or do you like when they're on the actual stock? Uh, I like them on the wheel because as you're turning, you're shifting, mm -hmm. you know? And I'm assuming this is why they have them so long. So you can kind of grab it from here or here. This is the best part though. The best Se part of the whole car? Yeah. <laughs> so far, secret compartment for my cigars. Yeah, you know, we should have asked them to give us the convertible to test drive because you know I'm probably gonna, if I'm gonna consider this as my daily driver, it's gotta be topless. Oh, 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 oh. 
Oh. This thing bites. Well, the tires are cold. Just gotta warm up at first. now why James Bond drives these cars wow guys it's an amazing car but my mind is still set on that roadster in the showroom I just gotta go in there and see it again hey what's happening go <laughs> this thing even beats a bike <laughs> I don't think it wants to race me I think it's a fan this puppy back I gotta admit this is the smoothest supercar I've driven yeah packs a whole lot of punch great braking power and so comfortable and quiet at the same time unless you really step on it yeah. comment below let me know what do you think of this Aston Martin I'm gonna go do more research and I got to make a decision soon so thanks for watching make sure you subscribe like the video till next week be safe be well People always ask me how I made my money. You see the Bugattis, Paganis, and McLarens, I've got it all from doing real estate. I've been doing that for 30 years, buying, selling over $800 million, and now I'm here to teach you because you got to learn it to earn it. So check out the links below and see you there. Oh, nice bike. Yeah, thanks, Be man. Be safe out there. Yeah, yeah. I love your stuff. Man. All right, you got it, Keep man. It up, Take man. care. Yeah, Thank yeah. you. See you later.